When it comes to deadly species, the black widow and praying mantis are fierce contenders. The black widow's shiny black body and red hourglass mark are known worldwide, and her venom packs a serious punch. Meanwhile, the praying mantis relies on lightning-fast moves and expert camouflage to catch prey without webs. Two very different hunters, but who would win in a battle? Stay tuned to see who wins this incredible showdown. But before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe so you never miss out on our upcoming videos. Physical Appearance and Adaptations The physical differences between the Black Widow and Praying Mantis reflect their very different lifestyles and hunting methods. The Black Widow has a shiny, black, bulbous body with a distinctive bright red hourglass shape on the underside of her abdomen, a natural warning sign to predators and humans alike. She typically measures about 1.5 inches, including her legs. This spider's smooth, rounded appearance contrasts sharply with the praying mantis' more elongated and angular build. The praying mantis features a green or brownish body with powerful spiked front legs that closely resemble the forelegs of a praying mantis insect. These spines are not just for show. They are critical tools for grabbing and holding fast to prey. The mantis camouflage helps it disappear into leaves and branches, giving it an advantage when hunting. These adaptations show how each species has evolved perfectly to fit its environment and hunting style. Habitat and Behavior Both inhabit very different environments and exhibit distinct behaviors suited to their survival. Black widows prefer dark, sheltered spaces such as wood piles, garden sheds, or corners of garages where they can build their irregular tangled webs. They are mostly nocturnal and passive hunters, waiting patiently for prey to become trapped in their webs. Generally shy, black widows avoid human contact but can bite defensively if disturbed. The praying mantis, however, is an active hunter that prefers dense vegetation where it can hide among leaves and branches. Unlike the web-spinning black widow, Mantis stalk or ambush their prey, relying on quick reflexes and physical strength. They are diurnal and move deliberately, blending perfectly into their environment until the right moment to strike. This difference in habitat and hunting behavior highlights their unique roles in nature. Venom and Danger to Humans One of the most important distinctions between these two is the threat they pose to humans. The Black Widow's venom is neurotoxic, meaning it attacks the nervous system and can cause severe pain, muscle cramps, and other symptoms. Though rarely fatal, Black Widow bites can require medical attention, especially for young children, elderly people, or those with compromised health. Their venom is a key weapon both for subduing prey and defending themselves. In contrast, praying mantis do possess venom, like most spiders, but it is harmless to humans. Their venom is specifically designed to immobilize their insect prey, not to harm larger animals or people. Because of this, mantis are considered safe to have around humans and even beneficial as natural pest controllers. This difference in venom potency sets them apart as a serious danger versus a harmless but effective predator. Hunting Tactics and Prey Capture The Black Widow's hunting strategy revolves around her web, which she weaves in dark, undisturbed places. When an insect becomes ensnared in the sticky strands, the spider quickly rushes in to bite and inject venom that immobilizes the prey. This method requires patience and a bit of luck, as the spider depends on unsuspecting prey wandering into her trap. On the other hand, the praying mantis actively hunts without webs. Using its specialized spiny front legs, it lunges at prey with incredible speed, grabbing insects with a firm grip. This ambush predator often targets larger prey relative to its size and relies on strength and agility to overpower them. The mantis' approach is more physically demanding, but effective for its environment, showcasing two very different but successful predatory techniques. Interaction between the two species, who wins in a battle? What happens when these two fascinating species cross paths? 
The answer is not straightforward and depends on the circumstances of their encounter. The Black Widow's venom is a powerful defense, but she generally relies on her web and prefers to avoid direct confrontations. The praying mantis with its speed and powerful forelegs can deliver a crushing blow to prey or a rival. If the mantis attacks first, its strength and agility may give it the upper hand. But if the Black Widow manages to bite first, her venom could quickly immobilize the mantis. In nature, these spiders typically avoid each other, sensing the danger each poses. The rare encounters that do occur are a tense balance of speed, strength, and venom. A true test of survival skills between two very different predators. Experiments and anecdotes. Real-life observations. In controlled experiments and anecdotal reports, introducing praying mantis spiders to black widows has revealed interesting behaviors. Mantis often show caution or defensive posturing around black widows, suggesting they recognize the venomous threat. Attempts to use mantis as a natural control method for black widows have had mixed results, as mantises tend to avoid direct attacks despite their physical advantage. These observations highlight a natural respect between species and demonstrate how spiders adapt their behavior based on perceived threats. Such interactions showcase the complexity of predator-prey relationships in the arachnid world, revealing not only survival strategies, but also an intricate balance of coexistence and avoidance. Pros and cons of each species in your home. Both spiders play roles in their ecosystems, but differ greatly in terms of their interaction with humans. Black widows can help control insect populations, but their venomous bite poses a potential health risk in homes or gardens. They prefer quiet, undisturbed places, so cluttered or seldom used areas should be checked regularly to avoid accidental encounters. Praying mantis, on the other hand, are excellent natural pest controllers that pose no threat to humans. Their hunting reduces populations of garden pests, and their fascinating behavior can even be appreciated by enthusiasts. For anyone wanting to maintain a pest-free home without risking venomous bites, mantis are a much safer and beneficial presence. Natural Predators and Control Methods Both species have natural enemies that help keep their populations in check. Black widows are preyed upon by certain wasps, birds, and lizards, and people often resort to pest control methods when their presence is unwanted. Praying mantis face threats from birds, larger spiders, and amphibians, but their camouflage helps them avoid many predators. Some have experimented with introducing natural predators, like mantis spiders, to control black widow populations. While the idea is interesting, behavioral avoidance limits effectiveness. Understanding these natural relationships is key to managing spider populations without disrupting the ecosystem. Fun facts about both species. Black widows are famous for their sexual cannibalism, with females sometimes eating the males after mating, a behavior that adds to their fearsome reputation. Their silk is incredibly strong, about five times stronger than steel of the same thickness. Praying mantis boast excellent vision, capable of detecting movement up to 60 feet away, and some can even slightly rotate their heads to better scan the environment. Both species play important ecological roles and display remarkable adaptations that have fascinated scientists and nature lovers alike. The wait is over. Final verdict. Who wins the battle? After exploring the unique traits, hunting tactics, and behaviors of these two incredible species, the moment you've been waiting for has arrived. Who wins in a showdown between the Black Widow and the Praying Mantis? The truth is, it depends. If the Praying Mantis strikes first, its speed and strength could overpower the Black Widow before she has a chance to bite. However, if the Black Widow manages to bite first, her venom could quickly incapacitate the mantis. In reality, these two predators tend to avoid direct conflict, respecting the risks each poses. But here, the definitive whiner is the praying mantis in this epic battle. Its speed, strength, and stealthy hunting skills prove too much for the Black Widow to handle. 
Thanks for sticking with us through this epic spider showdown. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and drop a comment below telling us which species you think would win. And of course, hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on more exciting battles and fascinating facts. See you next time.